me, Jeannie. Some of the wishes here give you hugs and kisses, like, comment, subscribe, watch, and I'm alive. And make sure you hit the notification bell to get notified time I upload. Thank you. Boobies. Yes, in case you already heard about what Ed said. Anyway, we're back at the Sims for the Watchful Rider with Bryn, and and before I could get this on camera and, and everything else, Angel gave birth to her three puppies with with Mr. Wiggles. <laughs> All three of the puppies are right there sleeping. Looks like one of them's about to wake up. We have Cheerio. Clint picked out Cheerio for one. I did. Then we have Flash, and then last but not least, Scotch. Cool. They're all so cute. I can't decide on who my favorite puppy is, but they're all so cute. So I'm. But Brynn does need to get her book done today. Uh -huh. And it is Easter. I mean, Brynn did have a lot of fun. Last night with Wally. Probably the most fun she's had in a while with, you know, someone. Especially with a friend. She was really nervous and everything, but but overall she had a, she had a really fun time. <clears throat> I'm sure her I'm I'm sure her dad would would be very proud of her right now for for meeting. Meeting a new friend. I don't think they're technically friends on here, but... Or maybe they are now. It says they're acquaintances, but... I think they're probably close to the friend status. Friend's gonna be getting a shower. The puppies are sleeping. Mr. Wiggles, I, th I think, is awake. Friend's gonna go ahead and grab some breakfast. Friend's singing in the shower. Liberating? Yes, it is. It's oh. spring. Does she have any? Okay, apparently. Apparently, she doesn't have any breakfast in her fridge right now, so. Make some, uh, French toast. We don't have French toast 1 and 2 anymore, which is the funniest thing ever. It mm -hmm. is. It's almost different between 1 and 2. <clears throat> I, I like to admit, I've always made a joke about French toast 1 and 2. It doesn't really say 1 and 2, it just says French toast twice, but I like to call it French toast 1 and 2. That's just my joke. Because me, I don't know. It's just something me and Clem do. Looks like Flash is awake. Where do you up to, little Flash? Flash doesn't like the stove, apparently. Mr. Wiggles is saying, hey, Brent, uh, hey. Hey, Mommy, what are you fixing? <laughs> He's fixing French toast, Mr. Wiggles. I don't know if she has her book done. Let's just write a fantasy novel. <clears throat> it looks like Angel's awake. Yeah, Angel's awake. She did have, you know, she had hours of labor with her puppy, so... That is why she was sleeping for a little bit. <sighs> Brynn's gonna go ahead and fill up the bowl. Brynn wants to keep all of the puppies. She doesn't feel right giving them away. Because, you know, she loves dogs and everything else. Does she already have a fantasy book? Okay, apparently she doesn't. Brynn needs to work on that. Okay, I'm sure Clem probably has a fantasy book title, or does she have... Wait, does she have one in her inventory? No, she doesn't. Okay. I wanted to make sure that... I wanted to check and see if she... I didn't know for sure, so... She says, do tomorrow. Do tomorrow at 9 a.m. So she's gonna <clears throat> hustle and get it done. She's reacting cute to a cute moment. Aww! Angel and Flash are cuddling! That's so cute! What the heck? Um, lady? 
happened? I don't know why there's some... Who is this? Oh, it's Morgan Fires. I don't know why she decided to show up. Brent doesn't even know her. Maybe she went to the wrong house. I don't know. The book is called The Clockwork Carnival. That's what that's what the original title of this book is. Let's see. Clem, do you want to have a special title? The Clockwork Carnival. That's what. Uh, no, I mean that's what this is called. Oh. Yeah. Mr. Floppy's Easter Egg Hunt. It's inspired by Easter, apparently. Of course it is. Ooh, I can't even spell. <clears throat> Bren's writing a book in honor of Easter, apparently. Okay, what do you want to put for this one? <coughs> Mr. Oh. Floppy loves to hide Easter eggs so that everyone in the barnyard and the field can find them. Okay, hide, uh, loves to hide Easter eggs in the barnyard. And the field. And, okay. <clears throat> so... All the animals can find them. I can't even type today. Is that all you want to put? That sounds <clears throat> good to me. Okay, that would be enough to describe a book anyway. All the puppies look so cute. I think the puppies look more like a lab. All three of them look more like a lab than what <clears throat> dog breed Mr. Wiggles is. I think the coloring in Cheerio is really interesting. I don't really think any of them have that type of color. What the heck is going on? Angel, what are you doing? Um, Angel attacked Mr. Wiggles? Why? I don't know, I've never s that's not Angel's behavior normally. Just because of the puppies? Maybe Angel's a little bit... Um, what's the word I'm looking for? Jealous? Protective? <clears throat> Maybe? He's chewing up not normally attack someone. <clears throat> Maybe Angel's still... Not so happy after giving birth. I don't know. <sighs> I don't know. I don't know what's going on anymore. Apparently, they can sniff butts. Well, thanks for telling me about it. That's what it said they can do. It looks like Cheerio's getting a little bit hungry, so she's gonna go ahead and eat. They eat the bowl. Yeah. It turns out Cheerio is a girl, and Flash and Scotch are boys. They look the same, or are they different? <clears throat> they look different. Flash and Scotch look alike, but Cheerio has a little bit of a yellowish tint. So she looks a little bit different. I'm not sure how long it takes for the puppies to age up on the long lifespan. <clears throat> uh, it probably says right here. It takes them four days to become, 
I I don't know exactly how this works with this mod especially. Angel will age up in 68 days. So and, elder? Yeah, Mr. Wiggles will take 71. But he's younger than her. Yeah. Just a little bit. Looks like Mr. Wiggles wants to play... It's playing with scotch. I swear that that was so shocking to me. That's so unusual of Angel's behavior. She's smart, playful, and friendly. <laughs> I don't know if she would it said attack, but I don't know. I don't know, maybe Angel's not just freaking out a little bit over everything. <clears throat> Let's see, it looks like Brynn is halfway done with her book. I mean, writing a fantasy novel... It's out of her realm. <clears throat> huh? It's kind of out of her realm. Yeah. She usually, likes, she usually writes mysteries and things like that that she has dealt with because of her special ability <clears throat> but this was requested for her for her gig so she's gonna try something a little bit new she hopes it will go well and hopefully the client will be happy with it and if not then she will do her best to make to create it how they like it What's Angel doing? <clears throat> Angel is just sitting nearby Brynn and she wants, looks like she wants to play with a ball. So she can go ahead and get a toy from her little toy box over here. And Brynn looks like whenever she's done eating, she's going to go and fill up the food bowl again. I probably need to get multiple bowls. I'm probably going to go ahead and do that then. Probably would be best to get at least two bowls. I don't think, you know, that would be enough. Because puppies don't eat that much sometimes, so. I mean, a bigger dog will eat a lot more. That's for sure. Looks like she's almost done with it. I'm just focusing on the puppies today. I don't know why. Because they're adorable. Yeah, because they're adorable. Looks like Wally hasn't called Bryn today. Maybe... Oh, let's see the flower bunny. Uh-oh. It looks like Bryn already knows the flower bunny. Oh yeah, it's Easter, so the flower bunny's here. It's raining on Easter. It's been, it's been raining a lot this spring that I've noticed. I think it's the last day of spring too, so <clears throat> summer is summer is gonna be. Yeah, it's the last day of spring, so summer is gonna be coming soon. Well, tomorrow anyway. Oh, looks like the flower bunny left, left some flowers for Bryn. That was nice. I definitely want to start a garden for Bryn, so that could be a good idea. I think that we should start one for her. The flower bunny left a lot of flowers, it looks like. Snapdragons. Some tulips. And this one looks like a, a blue bell. I 
I hope that's all the flowers. Oh, never mind, it's not. Chrysanthemum. I see two of those. There, the bowls are filled up so the dogs can eat now. <coughs> Mingo's a little bit hungry. But anyway, Bryn is done with her book, so she is happy that she got it done in time, so she's going to send it to the client for approval. Oh, the client approved it. She got $3,012. Excellent day. They love Bryn Moore's work. Their feedback included praises for bringing back fan favorite characters, adding a new twist to old plot lines, and introducing a wholly new interest threat to be explored in later books. Good job, Bryn. You always do a, a wonderful job on what you do, especially if it's something that's. Especially if it's a book you've never. Or actually a, a genre you've never done before. <coughs> I think the puppies might be a little bit hungry, so they're gonna eat a little bit at least. It look, uh, looks like Mr. Wiggles was really hungry. All of the puppies are barky today. Are barky today. Mr. Wiggles has to poop. <laughs> yes, all you puppies are so cute. Especially with your little howls and little barks and everything else. Bren loves them. Her mom keeps- oh, that's her sister this time. Her sister is, is texting her about talent showcase. Ooh. Bren used to go to talent. Bren used to go to different talent showcases with her sister and things like that when they were younger. They went with their mom and dad and <clears throat> that a lot of fun. Ghost Rider for History Textbook. There you go. I've already done the research for the history textbook I'm writing. There are stacks, literally stacks of notes to go through. What I need is someone to do the actual writing. Some Something people will remember like history. People need to remember history. Help me out here. <clears throat> Brenda would be good with history. I think that would be perfect for her to do. Sounds like something that she would know. She does see does see different ghosts and everything, so especially especially some that have been from a long time ago. So I think it would make sense for her to do. When does it do? It's due Tuesday. She has a few days to figure out what she wants to write for it. What in the world are you puppies up to? Whoa. Cheerio ate the whole bowl. You're little. You ate the whole thing. Wow. Yeah, that's true. She probably was. Oh, I guess two puppies can eat on the same one. Rabid rodent fever. Who? What? Who has it? Is she researching it? How in the world? I don't know why that randomly popped up. But I think Bren's safe from any rabbit. Aw, Mr. Wiggles is sleeping here. How sweet. 
Angel's sitting there chewing on a ball. It looks like she needs to have a grand meal, but she's only one person. Now she didn't look for Easter, egg, Easter eggs either. I think it'd be fun for her to do. <clears throat> Why not? It looks like the puppies are have gotten full and they're gonna go to sleep now. That's normal. That is normal for a puppy, for sure. They sleep a lot and then play. Then they, then they act cute. I don't know, puppies are cute. So are kittens. Can't leave out kittens. What's going on? <clears throat> Apparently Bren didn't find that egg yet. She's gonna go and belt the balls for them. Since they've all eaten. She has hamburgers left, and she has two things of spaghetti. I think- oh, our ham- She has two things of spaghetti left. That's what her dad fixed for her. Why not? She loves to- why not finish your favorite food? <clears throat> Brian- Brian wants to go to the gym. The day. Well, it's getting late. Kind of late, Brian. Maybe another time. She'll go. She'll. She told him that she'll go to the gym with him tomorrow on a Sunday. <clears throat> Just to make up for it. She told him that she had a lot of work. She had, she had a lot of work to do, and she just wanted to relax after getting her book done. And yeah, he understands and. He'll wait to hang out with her tomorrow. So, so in next week's part, they'll be going to the gym together. There you go. Just have another father-daughter day. Oh, she looks like she just found an egg. Which one? She found she she found a common decorative egg. It's it looks like to me reddish orange and then yellow or gold. <clears throat> Alright, she's gonna go and brush her teeth whenever she's done. Because of course you're gonna not wanna have spaghetti sauce breath or whatever. Especially if you have garlic in it. That would definitely scare away Vlad and Caleb for sure. That'd be the best way to scare away Vlad. No, I'm just kidding. I think Vlad. My sister Angel has tried to get Vlad away with garlic before and he said it doesn't work. <laughs> so Angel was basically screwed from Vlad. <clears throat> Bryn wants to claw gaze with her dad. Why not? And she wants to harvest a plant. Yeah. And also ne in next week's park, I'll get started on her garden. Alright, I think it's time to end the video here. <clears throat> anyway, thanks for watching. I hope you found this heartwarming. Jump to the jail up in here. I always welcome. I love you all so much. Bye. Bye, everybody. Bye. Bye, everybody. Goodbye, everyone. It's Ed. I was on the one year this Kevin Arnold. Thanks for telling me, Fred. You're welcome. Goodbye. In the land. It's Edgar. Goodbye.